agree that was a very worthy winner of our prize. So now Keith is going to wind things up for us. Well, by the look of, uh, of all of you, you found it a very both enjoyable and moving experience. Um, I hope I'm correct in that. Uh, now we're coming to the thanks. Uh, we had a debate about that in the office, and we decided that uh, although I was going to say thank you to the staff and the volunteers for what they're doing, we were going to thank them all individually uh, on Monday, and they all know who they are. Um, uh, Mr. Evans. <laughs> But one member of staff, I'm afraid, I am going to thank. Um, and that's Stephen Evans, our campaign director, who's always walking along at the back, and you never see him. <laughs> um, and just to say a big thank you for actually organising the practicalities of these events that are always so demanding, and Stephen's always doing it and scurrying away in the background, unseen, uh, and making it all work so well. So a really big thank you to Stephen. Stephen said uh, the 12th uh, award um, and let's just see some of the people who we have honoured. Um, Mariam, of course we've already mentioned, Professor Steve Jones, the biologist at University College, yes and his books on evolution. Mina Ahadi, the founder of the German Central Council of Ex-Muslims. Evan Harris, MP, uh, and the much lamented uh, now late Lord Averbury for their joint work on the abolition of the blasphemy law. Southall Black Sisters. Sophie Inpelt, MEP, still doing wonderful work um, at the European Parliament. Somebody here called Peter Tatch on. <laughs> um, and then, um, in honour of the young human rights activist. Malala Yousafzai. Her, now she was the young lady who was uh, injured for wanting to have education. Um, and uh, she was very brave um, and uh, she was given uh, a wonderful... Uh, she's now actually uh, a spokesperson for women's education and she's doing very well in, in that and despite her, her injury. Um, and then Shafak Parvi also mentioned, uh, and then Aha, Charlie Hebdo. Mm. And we had a, a wonderful uh, event in Parliament uh, a few months ago to commemorate the uh, atrocity uh, in Paris two years earlier. Uh, and we had some honorary associates speaking uh, about freedom of expression. And then last year we had Educate Together, this is the Irish-based group for its work in challenging re uh, religious discrimination and privilege in Ireland's education system and setting up secular schools not just there but also here and that was very uplifting. Um, and the person that has been behind organising secularism, secularist of the year, uh, both the, the venues and the prize uh, awarding process and getting to that has been Terry Sanderson and that's the dozen of those and I think he deserves a special thank you for all of that work. So thank you very much indeed, that's until the next year, but remembering also for those of you who can get to Manchester on, I think it's the 8th of September, isn't it? It's only the second Saturday in September uh, at Manchester Art Gallery. We're going to have a, 
uh, a reception and uh, some short lectures uh, at the, uh, the unveiling of the Sicker portrait. So I do hope that I'll see some of you there. Uh, and thank you again for coming, and I really do hope that you enjoyed it. Thank you very much indeed.